Hi everyone, Reid here from CJD Equipment. Today, we're out at the Optus Stadium celebrating the 50th anniversary of CJD, founded in 1974. I'm sitting here on the beautiful Chamberlain R1250 tractor, which is one of the first tractors that CJD sold as a dealership when it first all began. Now today, still a beautiful machine, but it does leave a lot to be desired in terms of safety, functionality, and of course, comfort, which is amazing looking at the machines that we now have available today. Fast forward 50 years, and this is what we have here today. Volvo's fully electric L25 wheel loader. Of course, in today's world, safety standards have increased and we expect more efficiency, productivity, safety, comfort out of our construction machines. And this is what the L25 electric has delivered. The L25 wheel loader is a five tonne machine with a height of 2.5 metres and a width of 1.8 metres. Forward of the articulation section, the machine remains relatively unchanged from its diesel counterpart. You have the torque parallel linkage design from Volvo, which provides excellent visibility from your working area, as well as even and balanced parallel movement throughout your lifting range. The machine also comes standard with auxiliary hydraulics and a quick coupler so that you can easily interchange and use a number of attachments on your machine, providing great versatility. The machine comes standard with a 0.9 cubic metre bucket. Now at the back of the machine here is where the L25 electric differs. You have the 48 volt lithium ion battery system here. This battery pack here has 40 kilowatt hours of capacity, enabling you to power the machine for up to eight hours of runtime. The beautiful thing about the electric system is that it's fully maintenance free, which means you no longer have diesel engine related maintenance. So no oil filters or dealing with fuel. The electric pack here powers two electric motors. One is responsible for the working hydraulics and steering, and the other one is directly connected to the drive line. Moving around here, you have the DC to DC converter. This is powering the 12 volt battery, which is responsible for all of the secondary electrical components around the machine, such as your LED lighting and the HMI display inside the cab. How do you charge the L25? If you move around the machine here, you'll find the charging compartment on the side of the machine. You have two options to charge it. You either have the standard AC charge directly from your grid with a Type 2 cable. With this, you can complete a full charge in about six hours, which is perfect for that overnight charge. If you're looking for a faster way to charge the machine, they all come fast charge ready via the fast charge plug. Using an off-board charging system, you can complete a full charge in as little as just over one hour, perfect for that lunchtime break, getting you throughout the full day. The machine maintains Volvo's reputable care cab. So we'll make our way up and have a look. You'll see an orange step here with three points of contact and a wide entry leading into the machine. Inside the cab, it's very spacious with an adjustable seat, you have great comfort. Uh, it is very familiar. Everyone knows and loves the uh, Volvo wheel loader, so a lot's been kept the same. However, there are a few improvements to go over as well. So you'll notice inside the cab, there's a new updated HMI display. You navigate that through the new keyboard and jog wheel here, where you can easily navigate through the system and machine settings. That will allow you to adjust the wheel traction, uh, the sensitivity of the controls and also the flow of your auxiliary hydraulics. So everything what we know and love with a few improvements as well. So there you have it guys, over 50 years of innovation and research and development behind me. CJD have been experts in the machinery game for over 50 years which is something we're incredibly proud about. To find out more visit www.cjd.com.au or visit your nearest CJD dealership. CJD, big enough to trust, small enough to care.